Hi friends, so I wanted to talk about an issue I faced in my Corvette while driving it yesterday. So I got uh, this very weird service, the brakes, because the brakes are worn kind of a light, and I will upload the video right here so you guys can have a look at what happened. So I was cruising because the weather was nice, so I just thought I will take my Corvette out and while on the highway that's when i got this weird problem so it's gonna pop up and i tried recording a small clip and it'll it'll be up very shortly and and yeah here it goes so yeah that's that's the key problem i got yeah so i think what's bothering me now is that this car only has fourteen thousand miles and it has carbon ceramic brakes which are supposed to last uh more than 40 50 000 miles and i haven't even tracked the car so the car hasn't been tracked even once and and i'm like what's going on and 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 the the other bigger problem is i when i do an inspection on the brake pads they look pretty fine to me so let, let me try to show you it's pretty dark but i will use my flashlight uh, to show you what's going on so yeah that's the car and let me use my flashlight to talk about the condition so let's see if the camera focuses. Yeah, so as you can see, I hope the camera is capturing it. It has like more than 90% of the brake pads left. So let me go get a little bit closer. Yeah, so that's that's the pad. And this is pretty much the condition all round on all four corners. They're very even. The rotors look pretty fine. There's no marring or, or deep, deep grooving or any of that stuff on the rotors. And and, and for me to compare the, the pad life, now I know the ZL ones do not have carbon ceramic, uh, but just, just to show you, let me see if the camera captures it. Uh, I'm, trying, I'm struggling to find the right angle uh, to show that they're basically the depth of the pad. So yeah, this is not picking up, but the point I'm trying to make is it's basically exact same uh, pad um, depth left on this car ZL1 and I know this car only has 3,000 miles I got it brand new no issues with the brake so that's pretty much uh, the same uh, size width left on the Corvette so I'm, I'm gonna go and talk to Corvette world on what's going on on the car because I'm pretty uh, this has this is bothering me a lot obviously because I I, I know these brakes are very very expensive it's a seven eight thousand dollar brake job I mean, if you end up changing all the rotors, just the pad itself can run you fifteen hundred to two thousand um, dollars. I did some research, so they're telling that what GM has done is they have put a sort of an electric circuit uh, because these rotors are so expensive. So they don't want you to go beyond uh, the life of the pad and protect and save the rotor. So there is a circuit, and I will upload that image I got online here. So yeah, as you saw on the image, so if that circuit detects a fault, for some reason there is an, there, there is an open or the circuit has a break, it will give you that warning, which, is, which was just basically a preventive measure by GM, this being very, very expensive brake system. So I'm just hoping it's that circuit causing the problem. Uh, but the challenge is, based on what I'm reading online, even for that circuit, you have to change the entire pad. So you, don't, you do not get that part uh, separate you have to buy the uh, entire set of brake pads. And yeah, as you can see, let me see if the miles are coming. Uh, that's not showing up. Yep, so as you can see, it's, it's 14,000 miles, very, very well maintained, not even one track day. So yeah, I mean, look forward uh, to, to the update on this. And if anyone is facing similar challenge uh, or has resolved it, f feel free to share in the comment section and i would love uh how how you guys went about it so that's pretty much all for now i'm heading out i'm gonna take my truck outside because obviously that's the vehicle behind all of this and i'm just going out to grab some food and stuff so yeah stay tuned on whatever the corvette world says i will i will i will make a follow-up video on that